Hi investors, this video is about Bonfire Token and it's gonna be incredible, I promise. And have a look at everything, both the good but also the bad about it. So let's dive straight into it. And this is the website, which by the way, I'm gonna put in the first link in the description below. And straight off the bat, we are gonna look at the main selling points of this token. So first of all, there is a fine amount of tokens. There is this number that is ginormous, but yeah, the amount of tokens and cannot be changed. Now that amount is there to stay, they burn 30% and that's the way it is. And this is actually very important. I want you to really understand because if you, well, the price will tend to go up as for example, Bitcoin. Obviously this is not like Bitcoin, but the idea is that the supply of Bitcoin is not infinite. One day it will be all over, the miners will have to stop, but there is so much more on this token we need to have a look at right now. 10% tax on transactions and basically every Every time you buy and sell, 5% is distributed to holders and 5% is added to the liquidity of the pool. And this is actually very similar to what we saw for SafeMoon and also NFT Art Finance. So nothing unusual here. It's actually very good and actually incentivize holding the coin as opposed to selling it. And then there is the third thing right on this side and it's basically that you get 5% every time someone buys or sells Bonfire. But I've already told you one second ago and the second thing we're gonna have a look at is the roadmap because it's very important we want to understand what this token will be about and what are their steps to actually achieve the goals so first of all they're focusing on launching the website which actually has already launched and the one we are looking at right now and by the way I make video updates on bonfire token when any news on this cryptocurrency comes out so that you're always up to date then they are also building a community on Twitter and that's the one we're gonna have a look at as you can see there is a contest for the best bonfire token related meme and so this is actually very important because that's the reason why safe moon actually has grown a community so big to make it the most viewed token on coin market cap and that's very important guys because the more people get to know about bonfire token the higher the chance that this token will go to the moon and what I just showed you are the community contest that they're actually running on Twitter so so if you want, I'm going to leave the link in the description below again for you to check. And then they launch on CoinGecko. And CoinGecko is the very first exchange where you can buy this token, but you can also buy it on PancakeSwap. But to do that, you need to first of all buy BNB, so the Binance coin, then send it to your PancakeSwap account and then at that point swap it. But there is so much more we have to look at. Let's do it right now. And so we are back on the roadmap in May, which is next next month they have a marketing budget increase meaning they're gonna have to raise money for their promotional activities and then they also have more community contests obviously that's very important to grow the community but then and that's the kicker actually that's the main reason why I'm showing you this there is another listing and that's in white bit and white bit is not as big as Binance obviously Binance is the biggest exchange that you can possibly find but white bit is actually not bad the more exchanges start taking this coin the better and the more likely the price will go to the moon and you know that when news come out on this token I will make a video update just for you and by the way there is also another listing that is due in May and that's Delta another exchange so that's actually great news guys it's gonna be an incredible May full of listings and hey if you haven't got enough of bonfire and you really want every single news that comes out well actually I have good news for you let me show it to you. Back on the roadmap, June 2021, one of the things they're gonna do is to actually have a weekly podcast on bonfire yes that's one of the things they're gonna do and hey let's actually answer one of the most important question of all is bonfire token a scam well let's have a look at what we have on hand this is an audit that actually bonfire has passed and it's been done by desert finance yes that's not a joke there is actually a company called desert finance and so they actually carried out a very rigid audit so first of all they actually looked at their website then they also looked 
looked at the social media, the team response, and so on. So let's dive into it right now. Th so the first thing they noticed is that the website was registered literally a few days ago. They actually are just a couple of weeks old and the registration expires in 2020. So it's just one year long. So that's actually not a great start to be honest, but as you know, they can actually extend the longevity of the website. That's just a matter of money. They can actually raise money. And that's one of the things they are going to do in June. Actually, it wasn't June, it was May, but you know what I mean. They have it in the roadmap and they're going to get it done. And then the next part is the contract audit. Basically, they are looking for vulnerabilities, like weak spots where actually hackers can go and damage the website. And they found none. So these are all technical terms and jargon. I'm not even sure myself, but there are all green ticks, which means that it's good, right? And on this audit, they also show you the top holders of Bonfire Token. This is actually so important, guys. I've actually underestimated this bit because we're talking about whales here. We want to make sure that there is nobody with a ginormous amount of tokens so that they would dump the market should they just feel like doing it. And so the first one is 35% hold and that's the supply that was burned at the time of the audit. And so that basically includes both the 30% that was burned at the very beginning plus a 5% of all the transactions that have happened over the last few days. And the second biggest holder has got 6% of the maximum supply. And after reaching out to the team, we were told that this is not a team wallet and is simply just an early investor of the project. And so this is incredibly important, guys. 6% to actually the biggest whale. That's not too bad, is it? And the third wallet by size is 2.9% and that's the supply that was found in Pancake Swap because this supply is needed for Pancake Swap to basically function. So nothing to worry about and actually let's press on with this so far positive audit. This is the team overview and basically they're looking for the CEO, all the people behind this token. And as you can see, they say we are unable to find any information about the team at this time. Project owners, I guess, may choose to stay anonymous for a myriad of reasons. And so this is actually a quite big red flag. And I want you to pay attention. Obviously, if you invest in this coin, make sure to not put too much money in it. Not saying because it's a bad coin, but just because all cryptocurrencies are a very risky play. So do not go crazy on it. Do not go all in for certain. And so the next question is, how is the price doing for Bonfire Token? Well, since the launch on CoinGecko, let's have a look at it. It was Tuesday this week. Actually, the price has been going down, straight down for the moment. And to be honest, there is not enough data to actually make any sort of technical analysis. But hey, if you want to stay up to date on Bonfire Token, I will make video updates on this crypto because I'm very excited and so that you're always up to date. And by the way, if you want to buy it, well, one of the options is for you to get a Binance wallet. Just create an account with the first link in the description below and this way you're gonna get 10% back from all the trading fees and that is only through the first link in the description below. And by the way, if you want to know the latest news on NFT art finance, have a look at this video. The video on the screen right now are the latest news on NFT art finance. Good news or bad news? Click on the video to find out.